Hey guys, it's Rory from ANS Gear, and we're gonna look at a barrel sleeve or barrel cover today from Valken. So I have two different kinds up here. <clears throat> we have the Crusade in the hatch uh, pattern, and then we have the Crusade in the riot pattern. Now the hatch, I only have one color up here right now, but the crew or the uh, riot, I have in three different colors up here right now. It's a very straightforward barrel sleeve. It does have one feature which I really do like about barrel sleeves or barrel covers. Uh, so we'll get to that in a second. The bottom is just reinforced with the nylon on the bottom. Almost feels like a seat belt kind of material. So if for some reason you have this on your gun and you accidentally pull the trigger, there's no way that that paintball is gonna make it out the end of your barrel sleeve accidentally and come out and hit somebody like that in the pits or wherever you happen to be. Um, so it's super reinforced, super durable material at the bottom to prevent that accident from happening should you accidentally pull the trigger while you're just waiting around. The gun should be in a safety or off if you're not playing, but this will help um, give it that secondary level of protection. Um, nothing really going on fancy on the outside. It's just pattern for what they're, uh, you know, either the hatch or the riot or whatever it happens to be. Elastic cord right there with a, uh, the the slider for adjustments. Now they knot theirs right here. It's just a knot. You can pull it out and change the length any way you want to. Cool thing about their setups also is the bottoms are just knotted through a little eyelet. So if for some reason this gets caught on something and breaks, you're not out of barrel sleeve. Just take the broken part off, slide it back through, re-knot it, and you're good to go. Or if it breaks to the point where you can't use this cord anymore, just go buy some nylon uh, elastic cord at the craft store. Make your own. You can use a shoelace for all anybody cares really, as long as it's tightened on there um, to the point where you're not going to have it come off if you accidentally pull the trigger. Um, so yeah, adjustments. I'll kind of show you how it's gonna fit on there, these ones. You can loop it through this backside here like that use it like that or if you don't like that kind of setup you can adjust this to fit really anywhere you want and use it like that uh, I don't like a lot of excess hanging off on mine so I would probably run it all the way down just like that but it's you know it's up to you do it any way you want now the feature that I really enjoy with these particular barrel sleeves what happens when you accidentally shoot a ball inside of here it will happen everybody's done it um, now you've got a barrel sleeve that's just covered with goop on the inside Cleaning them can be difficult sometimes. To get down in there to clean it, you gotta fold them inside out, and sometimes you can't even do that. But these, they actually put a little tab at the bottom so that you can grab it, and you can pull it inside out, and you can clean it. It makes it so simple to clean these things. You inside it out, spray it down with a hose, wash it off in the sink, put it in a bucket, do whatever you need to do with it to clean it. Just use a towel, I guess, whatever. Um, and then when you're done, you just tuck it right back inside where it came from and you're ready to go. I like that feature. I like the accessibility. I like that it's easy to clean because you, it will happen to you. There will be a time when you accidentally pull the trigger just because you were not thinking about it and you put a ball right into the barrel sleeve. A lot of guys forget to take them off at the beginning of a game and they pull up their gun to make sure it's on and they shoot and boom, ball right into the barrel sleeve. So. Having that ability to just pull that thing out there, clean it off, and use again is super, super sweet. So, Falcon uh, barrel sleeves, a couple different colors. Uh, there's variations in patterns, there's variations in colors. So look at the whole list of what we got. This is the hatch in blue right here, and then we've got the Riot Crusade, blue, red, and gray. They're available through the website, but check for more color options. Order yours now through ansgear.com.